Hi friends, in this video sessions we are going to cover the fast addition tricks. Today we are going to do the single and double digit addition. For that we need to know some basic thing like carrying number, non carrying number and n number. Suppose 5 plus 3. So what's the answer of 5 plus 3? Is 8. Everybody knows that. So 8 is a single digit number. So it will be a non carrying number. But if we take another number like 5 plus 7, what will be the answer? It is 12. So it's a double digit number. So it will be called a carrying number. And the number in the O position, that is the ones position, will be the end number. So these three things, carrying number, non-carrying number, and end number, these three are important for doing the our first addition. So first take one number, like double digit number we are taking 39. And we are going to add it with 7. Now as we are following, following the Vedic Maths rule, we will go from left to right. Here in the left or in the 10 position, 3 is there. So 3 can come as 3. But we have to see that 9 plus 7, it's a carrying number. So 9 plus 7 is a carrying number. So 3 is going to increase as 4. And what's the end number of 9 plus 7? The end of number of 9 plus 7 is 6. As 9 plus 7 is 16. So 6 is the end number. So our final answer is 46. Let's, let us take another example. Like 88 plus 8. So here in the 10 position 8 is there and in the 1 position 8 plus 8 is there. So as 8 plus 8 is a carrying number we are going to plus 1 with this 8 and the answer is 9. And what's the n number of 8 plus 8? The n number of 8 plus 8 is 6 and 8 plus 8 is 16. So our final answer is 96. Now let us take another example like 24 plus 5. Now as we can see 4 plus 5 it's a non-carrying number. So as 4 plus 5 is a non-carrying number 2 will be 2 and 5 plus 4 we know is 9. Our final answer is 29. If we practice this method, we can even do this addition within seconds. Like 49 plus 5. What we can see? That 9 plus 5 is a carrying number. So what will be there? 4 will get increased by 1 and it will be 5. And 9 plus 5, what's the end number of 9 plus 5? It's 4. As we know, 9 plus 5 is 14. Another example, like 72 plus 8. What will happen? 8 plus 2 is a carrying number. So 7 will get increased by one number and it will be 8. And what's the addition of 8 plus 2? It's 10. So the end number of 8 plus 2 is 0. Our answer is 18. Let us take some other example like 35 plus 4. 5 plus 4 is a non-carrying number. As it is a non-carrying number, it the 3 will become 3 and 5 plus 4 is 9. Similarly, 48 plus 8. What will happen? 8 plus 8 is a carrying number. So 4 will become 5. 
8 plus 8, the n number of 8 plus 8 is 6, so the answer is 56. 35 plus 6, what will happen? 5 plus 6 is a carrying number, so 3 will increase into 4, 5 plus 6, the n number of 5 plus 6 is 1, as 5 plus 6 is 11. Another one, 25 plus 8, what will happen? 5 plus 8 is a carrying number. So 2 will get increased into 3. And what's the n number of 5 plus 8? It's 3. So our answer is 33. So like that we can do this kind of addition within a fraction of second. Hope you find it helpful. See you in my next session. Thanks for watching. Keep on counting.